Welcome to another episode of Uplifting Interviews with Total Strangers. We got a young man who just visited his brother who goes to UCLA and he's on his way home to China. You're going to China! Yeah. Oh my goodness, that's a long way away. Yeah. Did you have fun here? Yes. Yes? Yeah. And what is your brother studying? Uh, what, what, um, what's the uh, study? in UCLA. What subject? Uh, Finance? Uh, sci scientific. I'm sorry? Scientific. Subject. Scientific. Oh, yeah. scientist. And what did you study in school? My background is chemical. Chemical. Yeah. Is that your younger brother? Yeah, younger brother. Oh. And you had fun visiting? Yes. Yes. Where in China do you live? Uh, in near Shanghai, Zhejiang province. Okay. So when you walk to someone in China, in America, they say, how are you? And you say, good. And you say, how are you? And you say, good. Yeah. It's like a greeting in America. Yeah, just what, In China, what do they do? How do they greet in China? Uh, they always say, ni hao, chi de ma? Something like that. Okay, and what does that translate to? Translate means, hello. Uh, and have you ate your lunch or breakfast? A lot of that. <laughs> is that right? Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, knowing that my movement is um, being fantastic, yeah. Telling people that you're really good, which is fantastic, right? Mm -hmm. Extraordinarily good is the definition, actually. Mm -hmm. um, what would you say in China as a translation for that? Ch and Ch when they say ni hao, what would you say uh, to say I'm fantastic? Or you're just going to say I had lunch? <laughs> yeah. I guess it's not going to work in China, ladies and gentlemen. And there were all their billions of people. They, they're, they're just concerned if you ate lunch or not. <laughs> That's pretty funny, no? Yes. So, well, where did you learn English? Or did you learn English yet? <laughs> How was your English? Uh, actually, in China, um, over the, we touched the English in, only in the classroom. In, in uh, class? Yeah. But with your brother, you spoke Chinese the whole time, probably, right? Yes. It's easier. Easier. Yes, yes. Okay, so you work in China? Yes. In what city? I'm sorry? Uh, Hiding. Hiding, where is that? Uh, it's in the middle of the, between the Hangzhou city and the Shanghai. Okay. Okay. So, um, there's a lot of people in China. Yes, actually. There used to be a policy where you could only have one child. Right? Uh, it's used to two, but now, uh, uh, as part of the government, it's uh, encouraged us to have uh, two babies. Two now? Yeah. Okay. When you, when you were born, was that the policy, or was it after uh, you were born? In the policy. I'm sorry? Definitely in the policy. Yeah, we're in the policy. Yeah. So, but your parents have two. Mm, only one. No, your brother. That's two. Yeah, he's my uncle's. Oh, he's not your brother then. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's your cousin. Yeah, cousin. That's a little different. Yeah, a little bit different. <laughs> so he was born with the policy of one. Yes. You both were born one. Yes. And you want to have a boy or they want to have a girl when they have one? Uh, but for me, uh, I can have two. You can have two now, yeah. yes. Okay. Okay, so there's a little bit of a uh, barrier here with the, with the language. But uh, how do you say your first name? First name. Your first name. Frank. Huh? Frank. Frank? Yeah. That's not Chinese. Uh, yeah, that's not <laughs> Chinese. What's your Chinese name? Chinese name is Kong. 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 Yeah. Kong. That's uh. So, I want you to tell people in, in Chinese to be fantastic. Yeah. Say it to the camera. Fantastic. No, no. In Chinese, you have to say. Um, I want you all to be fantastic. Say it in Chinese. I'm there you go. Be fantastic, everybody. Thanks for watching and pay it forward. <laughs>